You are listening to the Horse Radio Network, part of the Equine Network family. Greetings, everyone. Coach Jen here, and thanks for tuning in to Horse Tip Daily, episode 1477, brought to you by Equiotic, live probiotic supplement for horses. Today's tip features another handy barn hack from Michelle Barr, and this time she has a great solution for keeping your horse from getting diaper butt or trashing his tail in the horse trailer. Well, Michelle Barr is back with us with some more practical, wonderful, I never thought of that kind of tips. What have you got for us, gal? (laughs) Well, I am so happy because I have a brand new horse trailer. Ooh, very special. I I love it. I love it. And everything is new and soft and supple and happy in it. But not everybody has a brand new, soft, supple, happy horse trailer. And I intend to keep this one long enough that it will not be new and soft and supple. (laughs) You're going to use it till it rots. (laughs) Yes, I will, just like the last one. And when it gets to that point, and we can all identify it with this, those of us that have butt bars on the trailer, and the the covering over the butt bar, it's black and it's not really neoprene. It's not really plastic. It's, I don't know what it is. It's some mystery material. Yeah. yeah. And, you know, they sweat on it and it sometimes gets the weather on it. And eventually it just degrades and gets crunchy and pokey and scratchy. And then if you've got one that wants to lean back there already, now he's not only messed up his hair, maybe you're just hauling in for the day. And now he's wrecked his braid. Now you got to start over. The hair's all broken. His butt's all scratched up. You're painting a pretty bad picture for me here, it's huh? It's gross. It's gross. Right? Save me. So here's the, here's the easy way to deal with this. Go get a $2 girth tube. Hold it up on your, on your butt bar. Cut it off where it's too long. And then now you can take the doggone thing off and go home and wash it. What a brilliant idea. And he's got a cushy little thing to sit on now. He doesn't wreck his tail or his hair. You get the girth cover. It's easy on, easy off. It's washable. Mm-hmm. It comes in nifty colors. Yes, it does. Yeah, because Toclat makes fleece in every color of the rainbow and then some. Yes, they do. They do have colors there at Toclat in their in Some their of them are pretty crazy, too. Fleece. They are not in the rainbow. They are no, totally man-made not. colors. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> You will not find them in the natural prism. Yes, I agree with that completely. And well, and yeah, depending on the, how how long your butt bar is or how mm-hmm. long your fleece skirt cover is, mm-hmm. you could get two out of the deal. You could, and the trailer that we had for many many years, um, we had it was a stock trailer on the outside, but it was a right. straight load, you know, right, so it had a right. divider in the middle. But the front bar was just. A bar, just like the yep. back. And yep. you could put one on there because their yep. chest would get the little rub marks on it and stuff. Yeah, because, yeah, some of those have that have the chest bar on them. In fact, mine does, too. Um, yeah, I see a lot of girth covers in my future. That's a great idea, and they're so inexpensive. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and, you know, if it gets torn up, whatever, you've probably got an old one laying around already that you yeah. could just go slip on there, use the new one on the horse. Well, yeah, you always have, you get the bright white one or the shiny, beautiful um, buff colored one for showing in mm-hmm. and invariably after a season or three it gets a little stain it's not quite so bright yeah. anymore and it yeah. gets retired to the bottom of the tack, tack trunk and just sits yep. there yep yep but for uh mouse bedding so now you have a way <laughs> mouse to bedding. Do something other <laughs> and create a mouse family <laughs> mouse bedding that's awesome that's cool or you have the annual tack swap meet there are uh, always have, old girth always. covers there for a buck a piece. Yeah. And you Sometimes walk you past the Sometimes you can find the them on sale for uh, new for a dollar or two a piece. Oh, I want to go to shop, shop where you do. Well, I have to go up to your house to go shop because <laughs> we don't have anything here. <laughs> <laughs> it's all internet. Yeah, see, I couldn't survive with that because I'm, I'm going to pick it up and play with it, shopper. Oh, it's hard. Yeah, and I'm about due for a girl's day out tack shopping, too. All right. Yeah, it's midsummer. Time to go tax shopping, and I just mm-hmm. sold a bunch of my stuff at the used tax swap meet. Nice. <laughs> yeah, so I, everything I had in the in the swap meet was five dollars. Didn't matter what it was; it was five dollars. It's easy to keep up with that way. It's easy to price that way. <laughs> but I sold a whole lot of five dollars and stuff, so I'm ready to go shopping. You. I got money burning a hole in my pocket, so I'm going to yeah. go get some uh, some girth covers. There you go. And uh, keep those around, and just have a spare. You have the horse that trailers in. Gets the diaper butt all over the butt bar. You don't yeah. want to 
put that back on his oh, bike. Oh, God, no. He just slide it off and drop it in the laundry basket yep, and exactly. put a new one back on. Exactly. Get him home, hose him off, ready yep. to rock and roll. Exactly. You're a genius. Yeah. And if you're one of those people who can't deal with the fact that the butt bar is smaller than your, if you have the really big size fleece yeah. girth covers, it's called a rubber band. Yeah. We'll do the trick. Yeah. Just put it on yeah. the one end there and you're good to go. And you're off to the races with a clean fannied horse with intact tail braid. Yep. Score. Nice job. Thanks a lot, Michelle. We'll see you next time. Bye, Jen. And speaking of poop-covered horse butts, maybe your horse could benefit from a little help in that department. Today's episode is brought to you, as I said, by Equiotic. So let's talk probiotics for just a moment. Bluegrass Animal Products Equiotic Supplement is a live daily probiotic supplement for your horse. Equiotic is the only probiotic sourced from horses' good gut bacteria. This allows the good bacteria to survive in the GI tract. Clever, eh? Veterinarian developed and recommended, Equiotic is trusted by horse professionals to keep their horses feeling their best. From the top competition horses to backyard companions, Equiotic can help to keep your horse's sensitive GI tract feeling good. To learn more or to order, you can go to bluegrassanimalproducts.com. You can use the coupon code HRN for 15% off Equiotic packets and paste. That's 15% off by using the coupon code HRN at bluegrassanimalproducts.com. And by the way, more cleverness. Equiotic is also available at many retailers, including Smart Pack and Chewy. But the coupon code HRN for 15% off is only available at bluegrassanimalproducts.com. And thanks again to Michelle Barr for being our contributor today. You can find her online at rightly.com, Rightly Equestrian Center near Shreveport, Louisiana. Horse Radio Network has thousands of engaging podcasts for horse people, and you can have them sent right to your phone. Just subscribe via your favorite podcast player. This is Coach Jen, and I will be back again soon with another tip. Until then, go ride your horse. The Horse Radio Network and the Horse Radio Network hosts are not responsible for statements made by guests on the Horse Tip Daily. Please use your own judgment when listening to the tips on this show. <laughs>